Backrooms level 71 is one of those levels that you should literally avoid like the plague. Kind of like you avoid girls if you're like me and you're afraid to talk to them. Anyways, you'll see why it's dangerous later on in this explanation. But first, welcome back to Brugmas, everybody. Level 71 of the Backrooms is the 72nd level in the catalog, and it takes the basic overall appearance of an infinitely sprawling basement complex. Now, it's been given a class 2 difficulty and is generally unsafe with a low entity count, although, depending on how long you stay here, you'll probably think it'll get dangerous than a class 2. And trust me, it'll get worse. The deeper you go into the level, the more likely you are to physically and mentally fade away and never be seen or heard from again. Supposedly, this level has claimed thousands of wanderers' lives, and going here is a huge mistake because of that. So let's see why that's the case, why this level is so dangerous, and where these thousands of people have gone. The level's page itself is glitched, and some of the data here has an error message or an unknown thing, meaning that whoever, or whatever, uploaded this level, uploaded it from a corrupted device, or a bad internet connection, or too deep inside the backrooms to get the full thing out. But nevertheless, level 71 looks like a huge, unfinished basement complex. And all that unfinished means is that it's got a rough concrete floor and walls that are not complete. There's also rooms and areas and corridors that might not be fully furnished. The level is thought to be infinite and has no ending in any way, except right behind you where you spawn the level, there is a concrete wall that goes out in each direction. But other than that, right in front of you, there is nothing on any side except an infinite expanse of basement. Scattered throughout this basement, you might find a few random wooden beams or half-finished rooms like I was mentioning earlier, and these are the only landmarks or guides that you might find while exploring. So make sure you pay attention to them, because if you see them, that is literally all the direction help you're going to get. There are also absolutely no working lights inside this level, and there's no bulbs or anything, so the only way you're going to get to see is if you bring your own flashlight. Even with your own flashlight, the level has another strange and very anomalous effect that happens to every wanderer who comes here. The effect turns everybody's vision into a grainy black and white view. So you'll see normally before you come to the level, but you come here, you open your eyes, and everything you see will look like an old black and white movie. This effect happens throughout the entire level. It's really not outright harmful to humans, but it does become annoying after a while and it kind of lessens how far you can see because it's black and white. Now an interesting quirk about this level is that the images that you can take here are actually in full color if you use the flash, which I think is weird, but whatever, I don't ask questions anymore. The infinite dark basement has some other anomalies as well, such as a big one called auditory hallucinations, and these auditory hallucinations come in the form of echoes. So the level itself is obviously a huge concrete expanse, which means these echoes will bounce off of every surface here and echo and reverberate for a long time. The specific sounds that you'll hear with these echoes and auditory hallucinations will vary but depending on where you're at and who you are. But all of the sounds normally are faint whispers of good memories from something that happened in your childhood. Think of your childhood laugh, or your family singing you happy birthday, or your reaction to getting a present on Christmas Day, something like that. The source of the sounds is unknown, since no speakers or anything like that have been found that could produce them, and it's also unknown how this backrooms level knows these memories from your mind. Like, how does it know what they sound like? Either way, I don't ask questions anymore. This is just the backrooms, bro. Traveling further into this infinite sprawl of level, you might find more unfinished rooms and bathrooms that look half complete, and you'll need to watch your back when you go to these areas, because entities might lurk here. You also might run across a rough kitchen or living area too, it really just depends. All of these areas are accessed by walking through doorways, hallways, corridors, and just in general out in front of you. This means that there is no non-Euclidean geometry here, and it's all just a normal jumble of level that's confusing and all that. I guess it's kind of nice that you don't have to worry about non-Euclidean geometry, that, that stuff messes up everything, bro. But you'll still be lost in a dark basement, so I don't know. 
There are actually a few entities that call this basement home, and you'll need to be extra careful when encountering them, since everything's dark and you can only see in black and white, they could probably sneak up on you easier. Entities like hounds and skin stealers are the main ones you'll run across, both of which hide behind those unfinished wooden beams or old rooms and wait for you to walk through for an easy meal. You can also see a smiler or an insanity here as well, and insanities are decently common. Uh, these used to be wanderers that went to this level, got stuck too deep, and then went through the wretched cycle due to dehydration and lack of food and sunlight, and they pretty much turned into this subhuman zombie type thing. There's also a very rare entity that's been seen down here known as the business men. Now these creatures were actually first spotted back in level negative one, but they've been sighted here on 71 recently. Another strange connection that this level has to negative one is that that level also has a black and white grainy filter that every wanderer sees through when they go there. So because of this, some people think that this level and level negative one are connected somehow or are near each other. I don't know how that would work, but be my guest and try to explain in the comments. I have no idea. Maybe level 71 takes place on top of level negative one. I'm not sure. Anyways, these businessmen are tall, slender humanoids that wear dark suits. They have pretty much no facial features or anything that's very discernible about them besides being different heights. Some are tall, some are short. It doesn't, it doesn't really matter. They're just weird looking humanoid shadows with suits on. Now they're not outright aggressive and they're actually not even a threat at all pretty much because their motive is unknown. We don't know what they do. They kind of just walk around. Some theories think that they are the cause of those echoes. Some theories think they control the level. We don't know. That's all the information we have. Now under the bases and outposts tab on this website, it says that there are only three outposts that are quote, supposed to exist, end quote. Meaning that they don't really exist, but underneath that, it says these groups at the moment are unknown, 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 no, 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 end quote. So <laughs> whatever that means, sorry, they can't be good though. Now theories on that cryptic message range from there being a cult down here that kidnaps people, or there being a presence of a strange entity that does the same thing, or that somehow the businessmen are tied up in all this. We genuinely don't know what that means or why this page is corrupted, but I'm sure the businessmen have something to do with it. To enter the level, you do need to find a basement on level four, then walk down into it, and you'll end up here. After you walk through the door, it'll disappear behind you and you'll be stuck in this basement. So, sorry. To exit, it says, error, no possibility. So it looks like you're gonna be trapped here, but even further under the exit section, it says a bunch of stuff and it pretty much descends into utter madness. It says things like, quote, SH4DY or shady, which is referring to the shady gray. Then it says things like, it's so dark, I can't feel my arms, my body, who are you, what am I? Am I fading into the past? A gray shadow engulfing the light, layers of reality start to collapse, the dust, the sand, fade into the shade. I can't breathe, I'm fading, I'm fading. And then the last thing the page says is, help me, with this photograph attached of some shadowy humanoid. Whatever that means, I think it's gonna be cool. I think the shadow humanoid definitely has something to do with this weird effect here and the auditory hallucinations, but let me know what you think in the comments below. So with all that said, it is safe to say, don't ever come here unless you want to have the same fate as the poor, poor author of this page. On that happy note, Thank you so much for watching the video. Love you all so much. Check the links below for merch and for other channels. Yada, 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 you all the stuff already. Leave a like if you want more Brugmas. Tell your moms, your dads, your brothers, your sisters, your aunts, your uncles, everybody about the channel. If they want to get their liminal fix, they know to come to the Brugley channel. Love and appreciate y'all. Peace, and I will see you tomorrow. <laughs> it's that easy.